Cypher CX here, coming at you with another Elden Ring video. This time, we're gonna dive into learning how to parry. Alright everybody, so let's jump into it. We're gonna be learning to parry a two-handed spear enemy here. At first, I didn't know how to differentiate between the different light attacks, and it would confuse me and I would miss. Um, but here, this is where I ended up learning it. Even with the thrust attack, the light thrust, you can parry that. And you'll see a couple of other attacks that I really didn't realize that you could. Gotta get some dodges. You can parry that attack he just did. This is gonna be another parry. But I thought this was um this was kind of an interesting video to make because reading the attack sometimes can be hard. You can parry the attack that I just missed. That one you cannot. That's a power attack, and so is that one. You gotta dodge out of attack like this. Obviously, you gotta dodge out of the way of something like this. But then an attack like this, boom, parry. I used to be pretty scared of these guys, but now I'm not really worried about it anymore, learning how to parry them. As long as I have, you know, a shield with me, I'm good. Of course, you gotta look out for their specials, um, whether it be the tail whip, the, um, the ram like that, or the flying. This, another parryable attack. But now that I'm learning how to actually identify the attacks, it's becoming easier to learn how to parry any type of enemy at this point. Something like that, you have to dodge. You gotta dodge something like that. And, of course, you can't parry that either. Here, you're gonna catch me dodging again. And this next attack, I should be able to parry. Yep, got this. I was so excited for myself at this point. I was so happy that I finally learned how to parry this guy. I think I died like five times just trying to learn how to parry him. I could have killed him any other way if I wanted to. Those two attacks are not parryable, by the way. I learned that during this time. They were, uh wound up attack so they're unparryable but this totally parryable which ultimately is going to lead to his demise and here we're going to be able to parry this next attack and boom even the back swings you could do so that's how you parry the well, crucible i appreciate you stopping and taking a look at the video i hope you learned something about parrying two-handed weapons at this point um, for me, it's still something that's new. Uh, I'm usually a two-handed weapon, or I use magic, or uh, I use katanas, so pairing was never really something that I was doing, and I decided to learn it. If you guys enjoyed the video, like and subscribe, follow me on TikTok, follow me on uh, Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash cypherCX. If you guys have any questions, let me know. I'm, I'm excited to hear from you. Take care.